whilst many fanciers have preferred to use their iPigeon without using the iPigeon Club Manager, this will not now be possible where clubs are using the new RPRA results software. Remember, if needed, the iPigeon Club Manager can have a whole season's races entered into it. We do need to point out that with the growing need for joint liberations like the NFC, MNFC and BICC, the iPigeon Club Manager has to identify joint liberations and this is covered in this film. Should your club not be experienced in using the iPigeon Club Manager, we have the short version Club System User Guide instruction manual which can be obtained by contacting your iPigeon agent. Before using the iPigeon Club Manager, you must make sure all participating iPigeon clocks have the latest version number and this number must be at least version 8.84 as you see here. Select system info on the iPigeon. If any of the clocks are not up to date we have this short version iPigeon firmware updating user guide which can be obtained by contacting your iPigeon agent. So let's now proceed with instructions on how to use the iPigeon with the RPRA software. We firstly need to open our club manager on the computer. Then we select the races tab and it's important to remember only check mark this customized lid point if the race point is not already in the club manager. And here in this demo we are presuming you have not previously set up the race we are demonstrating. Now select the add new button then check mark customize lid point. Then select your club then select the liberation date. If the race is not on the same day as entering these details then in liberation time enter 0400. Next enter the liberate site abbreviation which has a maximum of 10 characters. In liberation code then most importantly you must accurately enter the RPRA race code number and these lists can be downloaded from the RPRA website. Next in liberation site enter the name in full. Then after double checking all your inputs finally select the save button. As you can see our race is now listed and that race point will be available for any future races but without the need to check mark the customized lib point. This has concluded the first part of the club manager race setup using a standard RPRA named race point. We now need to advise how best to set up a joint liberation race which is exactly as we have just demonstrated except for the liberate site abbreviation name and liberation site name. So moving on from the save screen we just left. Now select the add new button then check mark customize lib point. Then select your club. Then select the liberation date. If the race is not on the same day as entering these details then in liberation time enter 0400. Next enter the liberate site abbreviation. Note for demo purposes we are firstly using the NFC initials before the actual race name. In liberation code then most importantly you must accurately enter the RPRA race code number Next, in liberation site, enter the name in full. Then after double checking all your inputs, 
Finally select the save button. As you can see our race is now listed. We strongly advise clubs to do a test joint liberation of two or three races rather than risk a problem in an actual race. Before synchronising newly created races from the club manager into the iPigeon, make sure you have closed and deleted all old races in the iPigeon. We are now ready to synchronise a Newbury race to the iPigeon, so make sure the iPigeon is connected to the ring marker, which in turn is connected to the computer. Select Club Manager icon. Then show security fob to the ring marker well. Then select connect to PC icon. In club manager select tab clock operation. Then select tab synchronize clock. Then button sync now. The yellow progress bar will eventually change to a green bar reading clock synchronize success. The iPigeon screen will have changed to Clock Synchronize Success. Now go to the iPigeon Home screen and select the Home icon. And you can see the Newbury race is now displayed ready for use. On marking day, you take the iPigeon and birds to the club. In this demo case, our single marked bird arrives at the loft. Later, you take the iPigeon to the club for race closing and printing the race arrival sheet. After race closing all clocks, the secretary edits the race details in Club Manager to give the actual release time and also the race date if it was changed after basketing. You now connect the iPigeon to the ring marker which is connected to the computer. In Club Manager select tab Races. Then right click on the race name and select Edit Point. In this case, we are only correcting the release time to 13 15 hours. Then select the Save button. Next we select Tab Clock Operation. Then Tab Result Upload. And in Race Code select the race required. And eventually the yellow bar changes to a green bar. Next select tab Races. Then right click on the race name and select Result. Next select button Result Export XML. On the file name insert after the date the race point name. Then select button Save. Now close down Club Manager and open the RPRA result software. Then select the button iPigeon. Next select the required race. Then select the plus to expand the folder which now lists the saved files. And select the required file. Then select button Read File. Then select the Save button. 
Then finally select the Save button as this concludes these instructions and you continue from here to follow the RPRA software instructions.